Hello and welcome to this video on Power BI. In this video, let us take a look at how we can connect to Azure Cosmos DB from Power BI and load data from Azure Cosmos DB into Power BI. I already have Azure Cosmos DB set up in my system in Azure. Uh, to connect to Azure Cosmos DB, I'll go here into Get Data option and I'm going to click on More. So I will see an Azure option here. We have two connectors as far as Cosmos DB is concerned. One is under development and one is already set up. So we are going to use the Azure Cosmos DB V1. The moment I click on connect, it is going to open a window where it is going to ask me the URL and database and collection, which are optional informations. To get the URL, I'm going to go to my Azure Cosmos DB account and I'll going to click on keys. So here I'll see what is the URL to which I can connect to. I'm just going to copy this to my clipboard, come here, enter the URL and what is my DB? In, in this case, my DB's name is sample DB. I'm join, just going to give it and click on OK. So only way I can authenticate to Cosmos DB is using the account key. And where can I see the account key? I'm going back to the portal. I'm in the keys section. I'll have two different keys. One is for read and write operations and the other one supports only the read operations. So I'm just going to copy this key and I'm going to put it here. So the moment I click on connect, it is going to connect to Azure Cosmos DB. This is going to show me the sample container. So inside sample DB, there is a sample container and which is what I'm going to see here. I'll click on transform data. Now this is going to open me the power query where I'll see all these entries. Now I'm going to just expand this so this is going to show me a certain number of columns. So how do I know if my data is getting imported as expected? I'll go back to my Cosmos DB, go into Data Explorer and here I can actually access my database. So I'm going to click on items and this is going to show me all the data that is present in the items table. For example, you see here, right? So the first record, it has ID, category ID, and these are all the other columns which are present. So in Cosmos DB, every record in your table is going to be displayed as a document. So for the first record, this is the document. I'm just going to copy this category ID from here. I'll go back to Power BI and check if I have this category ID present. So as you see, I'm seeing this category ID present here. So which means we are, what we are seeing here is the actual data that's present in Azure Cosmos DB that which we are seeing here. That's how you connect to Azure Cosmos DB from Power BI. There is also another way using which you can report uh, on data from, Power, from Azure Cosmos DB using Power BI. So here if you go into the integrations, you will have to set up Azure Synapse link to your Azure Cosmos DB and then from that you can start building your Power BI report.